Thank you, Zach. With Senate Democrats last night striking a deal to end their filibuster of a bill to extend the waiting period for an abortion, abortion rights advocates are in a filibuster of their own on the Capitol steps. An organization called Progress Missouri is talking nonstop with internet streaming for 72 hours, the length of the proposed waiting period between a consultation and an abortion procedure. They're also upset that lawmakers have refused to expand Medicaid. I need to call attention to the fact that the legislature is spending this last week of session working on these ridiculous bills that do nothing to help increase access to health. Democrats agreed to let the abortion waiting period legislation move in exchange for withdrawal of legislation involving voter ID and union dues withheld from state paychecks. The abortion bill is now back in the House for final consideration. Another vigil at the Capitol tonight, this one for Medicaid, community, faith and health policy leaders held a candlelight vigil on the Capitol steps to highlight the human cost of not expanding Medicaid. They placed some 700 blue Luminara on the Capitol steps to represent the lives they say will be lost in the coming year if Medicaid expansion does not occur. For example, somebody who has diabetes, who isn't able to control it through simple medication and preventive care, um, could possibly lose their lives um, because it becomes uncontrollable and they have kidney disease, etc. And so it's something that's very preventable that turns into a loss of life because they do not have access to health care. Advocates say expanding Medicaid to an additional 300,000 people will create 24,000 jobs and bring billions of federal tax dollars back to the state. Critics say the out-year costs are prohibitive with no assurance that Washington will maintain its funding commitment. Thousands of shoes covered the Capitol lawn and steps during the noon hour today. They were placed there by volunteers to reorganize the efforts, or to recognize, I should say, the efforts and importance of the foster care system. May is Foster Care Awareness Month. These shoes represent our 10,100 children in the foster care system. Most of the time, these children over the age of 12 are considered unadoptable. They're not bad kids. They came from bad situations. The Central Missouri Foster Care and Adoption.